Thanks. Uh, I have two topics. Um, first on Senator Menendez, uh, did the White House know that an indictment was coming today? And does the president believe that the senator should resign? So a couple of things. Um, I'm going to be really careful here. This is a, uh, a not comment because this is an active matter. Um, we learned about this just like all of you. Uh, but again, this is an active matter, so I'm not going to comment. Um, no comment on our resignation. I, I'm just active matter. I'm not going to comment. Uh, on, uh, the U on the UAW strike, the UAW has invited President Biden to the picket line. Uh, I'm wondering if uh, he's going to he has any plans to go. And also, uh, they, they, the strike is expanding to 20 states. Um, is the president going to feel more pressure to move both parties towards uh, a resignation, a resolution? resolution? So, a couple, yep. On your first question, I don't have any updates uh, to the president's schedule uh, at, at this time. Just don't have anything to share. But certainly, the president appreciates uh, the uh, Sean Fain's uh, in, inviting him, including him, uh, certainly with the with all the family and friends of the UAW. And so, the president has been really clear about this. He believes uh, the un the union built the middle class. That's something that he has said for for years now. And of course, he is a union guy who will continue to fight for UAW and also union workers. So that will not end. Uh, that is something that he has certainly been steadfast about for the past uh, several years. Uh, so we are, uh, of course, in touch uh, with the parties. As you know, uh, Acting Secretary of Labor Julie Su and also Gene Sperling have been in regular touch for the past uh, several weeks uh, with all parties. Uh, certainly, um, uh, the parties uh, continue to remain at the negotiation table, which is incredibly important. And so we've communicated uh, to uh, to each of them the importance of continuing to work 24-7 uh, to get to a win-win agreement, uh, as you've heard us say many times. And look, the auto industry will remain here in America. That's what the president has been working for, towards, investing in that in the last two years. And, uh, you know, UAW uh, workers remain at the heart, the heart of a growing industry. And so uh, we will do anything, everything that we put possibly can uh, to help in any way that the parties would like us to. Uh, but again, they are at the negotiation table, and they, we believe that's incredibly important.